everyone and welcome to day nine of the 30 day challenge. So my name is Shibby Williams and I am your health, wellness and fitness accountability coach. Well, we are back into this challenge doing both challenges today. So if you are new to the challenge, let me first welcome you and let me tell you what we're doing. We are doing an arm challenge and the second challenge is what's called a butt and a gut challenge, right? So those are the two challenges we are doing for the month of December. You can pick either challenge to do or you can do both challenges with me. Today, I am excited because I am adding a few different um, moves. For those of you that are a little bit more advanced, I usually just stick kind of to the beginner exercises, but I'm moving to do some more advanced exercises for those of you that need the advanced exercises. I'll still do some beginning exercises as well for you beginners. Let's get started. We are going to start with our arm challenge first. Let me get my mat here straightened up. Okay, so what I usually do is I go on my knees. I'm going to grab some weights. And you can use however many pounds you want. You don't have to use weights at all. So if you're a beginner, you don't have to use weights. If you don't have any weights, these are only two pounds. Um, you can use cans or you can use water bottles. Water bottles are also very good. So I'm going to get on my knees just so you can see my arms instead of standing up. So the first thing we're doing is arm circles. Everybody's arms are out. We're doing 15 arm circles to the front. Let's go. This is one and two. So keep your abs tight. Back is straight. That's a four. Make sure you're breathing. That's a six, I do believe. <laughs> Seven and eight. We're not in a rush. Ten. We have five more to go. Five. Abs tight. Four. Make sure you're breathing. Three. Two. And a one. Arms down. Hands out to the side. We're doing um, arm raises. So here we go. We're doing 15 of these also. Let's go up. One. Again, when you go up, make sure you're breathing out. That's two. And up, that's three. We're really getting a good workout in, right? The slower we go. So breathe out. That's four. Abs are tight. Back is straight. And let's go up. That's six, I do believe. Try not to rock. Seven. When you get to the top, squeeze, right? Squeeze going up. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. That's eight. Come down. This is nine. I'm feeling it already in my shoulders. I can't believe that. And this is 11. Make sure you're breathing. Keep your abs tight. 12. So you don't really need heavy weight to feel it if you're squeezing. And let's go. 14. One more. And 15. Great job, everyone. Gotta look at my paper and see what we gotta do next. Uh-oh. Um, so next on our list are arm raises. Oh my goodness, I forgot what these are. That's okay. I'm gonna come back to them. We're gonna do our cobra push-ups since I can't remember all, and I have it written down. So Let's go ahead and we're going to lay on the floor. My dog's have been on my mat. So we're going to lay down and we're going to get in this position here. Okay? This is our cobra position. We're just bend, bending our elbows like this. Okay? And we're doing seven of them. Let's go. Down. One. Two. Make sure your abs are tight and you're breathing when you come up. Four, five, six, and seven. Great job, everyone. 45 second plank today. Excuse me. So I'm going to show you a couple different things that you can do during this 45 seconds 
You can do it the whole entire time, or you can just um, do the alternative ones. Or if you're a beginner, you can just stick to the beginning exercises. I'll do the beginning ones first that you can, so you can see them. If you are a beginner for the plank, you can use a chair. You can do them on your knees. Um, those are the two moves you can do. I'm going to do all the moves, including the more advanced ones, for those of you that want something more advanced. And I'm going to grab weights for the more advanced moves. So let's get started. I can't believe I forgot. Now, we are doing 45 second plank. And I like to start on my hands. But right now, I'm just going to start in the beginner's position. No, lady, move. So I'm, I'm going to start in the posi beginning position. So let's get started. We have 45 seconds. If you're a beginner, you can start right here. And this is what you hold the entire time. Okay, here we go. So this is the beginner. I'm squeezing my butt. My shoulder, elbow, and wrist are all aligned. I'm looking ahead. From here, you can just go right on your toes and stay on your hands. This is another move. From here, you can also go on your elbows, always making sure your shoulder and elbows are aligned. Okay? This is another position. Make sure your abs are tight and you're breathing. Now, if you want something a little bit more advanced, what I did was I brought the weights over. I'm going to take the weights, and I'm going to go in a plank like this. The other thing you can do is you can do this. And that's our time. That was 45 seconds. So, great job, everyone. So, right now, we're going to go ahead and stand up. We're going to go ahead and do our gut and butt challenge. So, what I did today was I brought some weights with me. And we're going to do squats first. So, I'm actually going to take a kettlebell. You can use weights. So, this is the more advanced. You don't have to use weights again. You can just do regular squats. Today, I'm going to use a kettlebell for the squats. Okay? So, I'm going to stand to the side. I'm going to have my legs shoulder width apart. And... For squats, we're doing 15, 15 squats. Actually, we're doing lunges today. Huh. Maybe I didn't get enough sleep last night. I'm going to use my dumbbells and do the lunges. So, leg forward. I have dumbbells. You don't have to use the dumbbells today. You can just use no weights at all. And here we go. We're going to go down, making sure our knee does not go over our toe. So the front leg, that's one. Down, two. Make sure you're squeezing when you come up. Three, four. Breathe out, abs tight. Five, six, seven, eight. And nine, ten, eleven. Okay, make sure you're breathing out and squeezing when you stand. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I'm going to switch to the other leg. These are ten pounds. Use whatever you have. I am going to use the kettlebell to do these. Other leg forward. So, with the kettlebell, we're going down and up, one. Make sure you're squeezing when you're standing, two, down, three. Back toe is the only one on the floor. This is five, down, abs tight, six. Breathe out, squeeze when you come up, seven, eight. Now, this is 20 pounds. And nine, ten. Again, we're not in a rush. Eleven, twelve. We have three more. One, and two, and three. Great job, everyone. Now, I remembered the arm exercise I forgot. So, this is 
like our chest press. So grab your weights, or you don't have to have weights at all. You just clasp your hands with no weights like this. So your hands should be right at face level. We're taking our elbows and we're doing this, right? So we're gonna push our elbows together. That's our move. So let's get started. We are doing uh, 15 of these. I'm out of breath from doing those lunges. Let's go. And out in one, two. Make sure you're squeezing. Three. Get your elbows as close as possible. And then five. We're not in a rush. Stand straight up. Six. I'm going to bend my knees a little. Seven. And eight. Breathe out. And ten. Abs are tight. Eleven. Go as close as you can. If you can't touch, that's fine. 14 and 15. Ha! Great job, everyone. So sometimes I mess up. I forgot what we were kind of doing today, but hey, that's okay. We got it done anyway. So I'm glad you all joined me today. Make sure you find me on social media. Look me up at Chevy Williams on Facebook, Instagram, LBS Fitness, uh, one word, Twitter, and excuse me, Pinterest. LBX Fitness, two words. Go out, purchase my book today. You can find it on Amazon. If you want a signed copy, go to my website at www.leadingbyexample.us. The name of the book is Who Needs a Gym? Question mark. And then using social media for weight loss. I'm so excited about the book. So let's finish pushing this challenge out. We're strong, we're doing it together. And I will see everybody for day 10 tomorrow.